All right, so today I'm going to be creating the lowest quality video on YouTube. I'm going to do this by... I mean, I don't know actually how I'm going to do it yet. I've not thought about that yet. I mean, I probably should have before I actually started recording. But now you might be thinking why I'm doing this for a video today. And the reason is, you know, I just make stupid videos. Let's be honest here. My videos are like the most random things ever. And not only that, but I think it'd be pretty interesting, you know, to see how low quality we can actually get. Now, I'm sure most of us have seen like a old shitty Call of Duty montage before. Like when you're trying to make YouTube videos at about 12 years old, which is nothing wrong with doing that, you know. But like most people when they're like 12 years old or whatever and they're trying to do YouTube videos, they don't really know everything. Like, even me, I was making videos when I was 12, not on this channel, but you guys have saw that video from me back then, like one of my commentaries or whatever. Today, I'm doing a free gun glitch on Halo 1. I mean, that could probably pass for the lowest quality video on YouTube, honestly. But you guys know what I'm talking about. Like, we've all seen one of those shitty old COD montages that kids make before they know what a capture card is or what an Elgato is or anything like that, and they just try to record it off a webcam or something. They are probably like the lowest quality videos you can find on YouTube. And today what I'm going to try and do is exceed those limits. I'm going to try and get a lower quality video than a shitty Call of Duty montage. And the thing is, I am going to be making a shitty Call of Duty montage for this video, you know, just for the sake of it. And uh, yeah, so uh, let's just get right into this. Now, I'm not, like I said, I'm not sure how I'm going to do this. I don't know how I'm going to make it so shit quality. I mean, it's pretty impossible to get like a really shit quality video in 2017. Because if you don't have an Elgato or any of that type stuff, there's always like the free stuff available. Like Xbox literally offers an in-game recording thing. But I'm going to try and get get to the equivalent quality of a 2008 COD montage. So this is the video that I'm going to be working with today, right? I'll show it on the screen right now. Yeah, so I thought the first step, it was necessary to make the recording a webcam video. You know, the TV has to be visible in the shot. So I guess the second step, you know, after recording with a webcam or whatever, like I said, I'm kind of making this up as I go along. I have no idea how I'm going to make it so shit quality. But I think the second step, it will be necessary to render it as probably one of like the lowest resolutions. Hmm, what have we got here then? All right, so wait, audio settings. Let's put that on 96 uh, kbps. That's the lowest quality audio setting they have. So, you know, we've got to definitely choose that. That. frame rate okay so we've got to put the frame rate on at least let's put it on 10 10 frames per second 256 144 the display size is 256 by 144 which is the lowest quality setting you can choose on youtube all right so uh, let's watch this then Alright, so I can definitely see an improvement in the quality. It's definitely downgraded by a lot. I mean, you can see just by looking at the TV that the TV is not even straight anymore. It's got all these bumps and everything. So we're making an improvement, alright? So uh, let's just remove this. What if we put frame rate on one? That's got to be absolute wank. Now that I've done that, let's look at this. Okay, I don't think any COD montage ever got that bad. That's pretty bad. I think what I definitely need now, and you guys know this, everyone knows this, but we need the Bandicam logo. We need the Bandicam logo at the top of the screen because we all know that it's just like a meme now. Let's record the latest low quality clip that we've got in Bandicam, which is going to make it even worse. All right, so the Bandicam logo at the top is looking pretty decent. Definitely adds to the low quality-ness of the video. I think the fact that I actually recorded the screen with Bandicam actually made it worse anyway, so. Now, before I re-render this in the lowest quality, what I'm gonna do is in COD montages, there's always music. Now I think to get really low quality music, what I'm gonna do is I don't know what it's called, but I'll type it in. I'm sure it'll come up. It's really popular because everyone uses it. I'm gonna record with my laptop camera. I'm gonna play the music for a speaker out loud. So <laughs> Okay, so after throwing in the Bandicam logo and the shit quality music, I think we might have our finished product. Maybe I can even customize the settings to go even worse than this. Oh, it's got to be between 64. Okay, okay, let's put it on literally the lowest it allows us to. Let's put it on 64 by 64. We can't put the frame rate anything lower than 5. I mean, we can, but it's just going to look like pictures. And I I don't know. I, I think that ruins it. So the audio is the lowest it can go. Literally, the one below that is no audio at all. So, so yeah, let's try this then. 64 by 64. I can't imagine what this is going to be like. This could be the final piece. Let's check it out. Oh, shit.
I actually did it. That is, if you find a lower quality video than that on YouTube, they, I, I just, what are they doing? Like, that's the thing. I don't know. What could, what could you record with that is that low quality? Like, I'm pretty sure you can't find a lower quality video than that. That was absolutely terrible. The Bandicam logo is just unseeable. I think it's impossible to get lower than that without trying. But, uh, yeah, so I think my goal for this video was accomplished. I challenge you guys to find a video on YouTube that is worse quality than that. But, uh, yeah, so I just wanted to make this video because... But uh, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll play the clip once more after I've done this outro. And uh, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please leave a like if you did enjoy. It really does help me out a lot and I really appreciate all the support. And uh, yeah, I think that's about it. So hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you all in my next video.